generator. This and so there was a video uh, about this little instruction here, which is uh, it's called World Simplest Electric Generator for Will for World Science Fair. So I'll give the the link in the description, and we tried making it, and it worked. Yes, look it did at work. that little. Look at that little lamp. Look at that little It's lighting lamp. up. It's lighting up when I turn when I turn the the magnets inside the box. So I'm inserting two very strong magnets attached to a, like a screw and sort of like a long iron nail you can also use inside a box that he constructed. Yeah. It's like a square box. Yeah, it's just a square box. Uh, although uh, I did tweak one thing, I attached a base to a box. He didn't have any base, so the guy in the video. Yeah. Okay. And what I we... just realized it's actually unwinding the. Yeah, wire. it is a little bit, but it's still working. Can you do that a little bit more? I'm so happy. There. What are we actually observing? Now uh, we can try to. Uh, so so this is the basic experiment. Basically, the reason why I thought I wanted to make it well, it's partly because of just just because of that same thing, but uh, partly because I I wanted to demonstrate one of the Ferrari's laws, but partly because I wanted to modify it. So, <laughs> well, now that we've got the basic experiment done, let's try to modify it. So. What did you want to modify? This is Faraday's law, right? Faraday's, yeah, yeah, Faraday's, yeah, yeah, Faraday's law. What is Faraday's law? A change in the magnetic field produces electric current. And the changing magnetic field is basically us rotating the two magnets in there. Look, they're, they really want to get closer together. <laughs> they're very strong. Be careful with the magnets. See? Whoa! Uh, this was a set up, basically, this is just like um, a box that we made uh, with, a, with a nail in it, uh, uh, which actually fixes the box partly. Partly, I've also fixed the box using some scotch tape. And you should make sure that it's not too tight because then otherwise it will be rotating. Uh, I've also stuck, uh, I stuck a bit of magnets. I've done 250 turns uh, to make this coil of wire. So, and then I've attached the ends of the coil. The ends of the LED to the coil, and then and this I, is a I, really. And then if when I spin it, it you can see the LED lights up. I don't think it's an LED, is it? I think it's a, it's a real lamp. I think it's a real lamp. It's a really but small bulb, but it's very very weak. So you should make sure you take a lamp that doesn't require a lot of electricity. Right, so now we know it works. Now it's time to play. What are you going to do? I don't know. Uh, specifically, I wanted to do modifications in how it spins. Because right now, we're just spinning it manually. Yeah. So, uh. Oh, you were thinking of attaching it to a motor or something. Atta yeah, attaching it to a motor or like, like, a, like a motor or like doing it with doing a gyroscope thing or like water or something like that. Okay. So, uh, well, we'll maybe follow up on this then, right? <laughs>